Chuck E. Cheese at Haunted Chuck E. Cheese. Everybody, please be sure to watch this video all the way through because it gets crazy. And yeah, comment down below your favorite kind of cheese. Unless you're lactose intolerant like me. And please click that first link in the description below and check out my gaming channel. Subscribe to it! That way it'll help me feel better. And let's go! What the? Where's everybody at? Dang. That's the same amount of people that showed up to my birthday party. <laughs> Anyway, and look at that face, man. I know you up to something, bro. You look like you are legit alive. Mm -mm, not today, Satan. He is alive, just like I said. Uh. Oh, creepy note. Look in the hallway. Why would you uh, investigating? Don't invest. Oh, wait, did you see that? Guys, look in the hallway. Look, 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 look. <gasps> oh. It's Chucky right there, waiting for you right by the bathrooms. Chucky, I know you gotta use the potty, but uh, sorry bro, uh, me first. Chuck E. Cheese performances be like, <laughs> what? Hey, is that Addison Ray in the middle? Addison, what are you doing? You got a new job, it's about time. It definitely matches your dancing skill. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm just, it's a joke. A anyway, and look at that mask on the right. Ugh, girl. Girl, if you wanted to scare me, you just had to show me your actual face. <laughs> Black man, me little at Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, the animatronic hell. Ah! I'm, <laughs> run, black man! Run faster than you've ever run before. It's so true though. I mean, these animatronics, they're so scary. Look at that. Playing guitar just like, I'm like, quit looking at me, Matt G's. Looking at me like I'm a piece of meat and you haven't eaten in three weeks. <laughs> Hello? Oh my god. Ah! What is this? Abandoned animatronics in apartment? It's literally a real life horror movie. That's crazy. Jeez. Oh, it's Chucky! Oh no. Oh, ew. Who made this? Oh. Well, good night. Uh, sleep tight. <laughs> Dang. Hello, true crimers. This is the case of the Chuck E. Cheese's Massacre. And as always, viewer discretion is advised. Yeah. This story takes place in 1993 in Aurora, Colorado. Okay. Wow, go figure. Before you young folk had Five Nights at Freddy's, well, we had walking, talking, living nightmares at Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, yeah. These animatronic monsters would sing songs to us, and they still do because they're still around. At this particular Chuck E. Cheese in Aurora, there was a disgruntled employee by the name of Nathan Dunlap. He was fired from this location five months prior to this event. So on December 14th, 1993, he would enter the Chuck E. Cheese around 9 p.m. He ordered some food, he played some arcade games, and then about 10 minutes to close, he went inside of the restroom and hid. Chuck E. Cheese closed at 10 o'clock that evening, and about 10.05, he exited the bathroom. 19-year-old Sylvia Crowell was cleaning the salad bar no. when Nathan pulled out his gun and shot her close range through the right ear. This shot ended her life. That's ridiculous, gee! I'm just not going to Chuck E. Cheese, okay? I mean, and not today. And what is with that photo on the left side, bro? Uh, you look high. Higher than Snoop Dogg. This is why I don't like Chuck E. Cheese. <gasps> oh, what kind of concentration camp is this? It's the Gulag. Oh, Chucky. Dang. I mean, look, I'm sure Chuck E. Cheese has made a lot of money over the years, but, uh, I mean, at what cost? All of these things look like they're straight out of a horror movie. Are you kidding me? What the? What is this? Ah! 
Oh my god, it's the animatronic without the head on, without the face. Wow, that's a like legit robot robot. Robots are taking over, I'm telling you. I mean, man, it's only a matter of time. All those movies, you know, where the robots take over, it's about to happen. Come on, man. Let's not lose our heads. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, wait, why does one of the animatronics have a bag over his head? Oh, that's not nice. What, just because that one's not as good looking as the other ones? Jeez. So you put a you put a plastic bag over it. That's that not nice. Oh, Chucky. Why does Chucky look like he just committed a crime? I'm like, are you kidding me? Bro, you look guilty, baby. Okay, I mean, man, the judge needs to sentence you to life at Chuck E. Cheese. You've heard of Five Nights at Freddy's, but have you heard about Bay Area's haunted Chuck E. Cheese? No. This particular Chuck E. Cheese used to be a toy store. Supposedly, a little girl had fallen from a third story window while it was still a toy store. What? Years later, and the store is now known as Chuck E. Cheese, you can even see Chuck himself in the window. There are many claims of people seeing the little girl's face on the third story and in the parking lot. There's also a tale of a little boy who fell down the stairs while looking for his mother. People now say that they can hear the mother's cries in the stairwell. It's actually really creepy. I don't know about you guys, but I think that Five Nights at Freddy's has nothing on this one. Uh, have you played Five Nights at Freddy's? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Katie, you're crazy, okay? Katie, you're crazy. Ah! Abandoned Chuck E. Cheese animatronic found in a landfill. Ah, girl, where'd you come from? Can't be sneaking up on me like that, unless you're trying to get slapped. This Chucky animatronic looks like it used to be a TikToker, <laughs> and then it didn't work out. Hey, is that Charlie D'Amelio in 10 years? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm back for more scary Chuck E. Cheese videos, so here we go. Our story today is about Eric. He just turned 17 and he was so excited to start his first job. Aww. His first day on the job, he was forced to go into costume. You know, the rat suit. He kept saying, are you sure I should be doing this on the first day? Yes. He was very nervous about it. The manager told him he would be just fine. So he did as he was told. Oh. When Eric got into costume, he noticed something strange. The fur on the suit felt very warm and strangely soft. He said it felt like a real creature. Once he was in costume, he went out to see the kids and he was so excited. But then he began to feel nervous and hot. But soon he felt the suit tightening around his face. He tried to ask for help, but it seemed that no one could understand him. Ugh. He screamed, help me, I can't breathe. But still, no one heard him. Dang, man. Yeah, for Halloween, I'm just gonna draw a little bit of makeup on my face. I ain't putting no costume on, no nothing. And how the heck is this girl talking without moving her mouth? Are you kidding me? Help me, I can't breathe. He yelled, but still no one heard him. He what? ran into the bathroom where he tried to hesitantly remove the Chuck E. Cheese costume. Oh he God. felt pain shoot down his spine. The more he pulled on the head, the more painful it got. He pulled with all of his strength to pull the gloves off, but it was to no use. What? He screamed through tears. Somebody please! He couldn't see his eyes through the holes in the suit anymore. Instead, he only saw large, beady, rat <laughs> eyes staring back at him. He ran to the employee lounge where he planned to get his cell phone and called for help. But as soon as the door swung open, he saw the manager. Eric! Hey, buddy! <laughs> You're just the man we've been Black looking man. for! Uh, we? Ooh, don't do it, man! Chug a cheese! I ain't going. I ain't going. And look at those eyes, man. Jeez, you look like you got glaucoma. I don't even know if you can see if somebody has glaucoma, but you know, anyway. What was that? What? I was ready for a jump scare right there. Woo -hoo! Don't you dare throw my cake away in the trash. You know what? You smelled and that's why you almost went bankrupt. I said it. I said it, yup. What? Yeah, what are you gonna do? You almost went bankrupt because no one likes you no more. No Dang. One. Kids forgot about you. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Well, I got you sad, huh? That's what you did, touching my cake. I'm sorry, hey, listen, I'm sorry, man, but you touched my cake, dude. <laughs>
You ain't gotta roast Chucky like that, dang. Just because he was about to throw away your cake, he's trying to save you from diabetes. But hey, could have been worse. But yeah, go ahead, click on the screen and watch another one. Yeah, man.